65,000 Canadians will begin chemotherapy this year. 600 will die because of its toxicity. These are patients being killed by their treatment. And the other 64,000 patients will experience side effects so horrible it can make their treatment feel worse than their disease. And all of these problems are the result of one simple fact. Chemotherapy is not specific for cancer cells. Chemotherapy interacts with every cell in the body, meaning it will damage not only cancer cells, but also healthy cells, producing toxic side effects. But it doesn't have to be this way. The goal of my research is to attack cancer and cancer alone, to deliver treatment free of side effects by targeting only cancer and sparing healthy cells. Let me explain. A cell is essentially a microscopic computer. Like a computer, cells store all of their information in a code and rely on programs to function properly. But cancer cells have a bug in the system. And this bug causes the cancer cells to become chaotic. With programs running awry and normal cellular functions deteriorating, it's nearly impossible to untangle this mess. But maybe we don't have to. Maybe we can use this chaos to our advantage. See, my work helped to uncover a special network of programs that are running in overdrive. This network is absent in healthy cells, but present in 80% of every single cancer patient. So in my lab, we created our own cellular program with the instructions to hijack this overactive network. Hidden deep within the program are the orders to trigger self-destruction. Cancer cells unknowingly run this program and soon they collapse upon themselves and are eliminated. The most exciting part, all of this occurs while having no effect on healthy cells. But there's a problem. And it's a problem that every treatment needs to overcome in order to be effective in patients. The treatment needs to reach the target. To solve this problem, my colleagues and I developed a special delivery vehicle known as a nanoparticle. I put the self-destruction program inside the nanoparticle so it could navigate the body and find cancer cells. When I tested the combination of nanoparticle and self-destruction program in mouse models of cancer, I found that it was able to stop the growth of lung cancer. It was able to shrink prostate cancer tumors by up to 90%. And in mice with colorectal cancer, it's cured animals of their disease, all without side effects. We're going to replace toxic chemotherapy and defeat cancer, one cellular program at a time. Thank you. Mm -hmm.